What's going on guys on YouTube? This is your boy Richard X Funny here and today even though it's been like a month when I haven't uploaded, I'm just doing my test, see how it goes. And um I just want to, you know, make a little quick video and say a big thanks to um Gillette, not sponsored, but they did give me this in the mail. A happy 18th birthday free razor and Gillette and Gillette. So thank you Gillette for, for this awesome gift. I actually needed this because as you can see, sideburns growing a beard. I used Gillette with my dad's Gillette, but then for NGRTC, since I'm out of it, that's why I'm going out, but I don't look I don't look my beard too shabby. That's why I need, you know, trim around here. To right here. So I want to thank you Gillette for this awesome birthday present. And please sponsor my feet and also just thank you so much. I'll do the unboxing right now using a selfie mode. So I did already open this and it's pretty nice. I don't want it up right now. So here's what it comes with it. So it does say it comes with a free razor and actually true. And it's a this kind of razor. Mm -hmm. A perfect razor because it glides. As you guys can see, tight grip. And it, say, and it says right here, you guys should read it, because it comes with the two coupons. You know, two coupons. Holla at your boy. And also a little 18th birthday story. Of course, you know, it says something like, uh, first shave, first serve. Or, you know, first concert, for, for real concert, I don't know. But it just tells you a lot of things. Like, you know... Like this right here, you know, that the kids showing. I mean, it's awesome gift. Thank you so much, YouTube. I mean, thank you so much, Gillette. And um, I want to thank you so much. You know, I've been 18. Like it's been a month, but it's alright. Got so accepted no matter what. So thank you guys so much for being this out here, Santa. I know it's been crazy, but now I want to say thank you so much, Gillette, for. For, for doing this for me I think for my I think for like you know helping out for other guys not just me but other guys that have trouble shaving plus with me because I'm a shave like in a while but my brother he trimmed my dad he trimmed and you know, my grandfather too my uncle everybody in my family has a beard except for the ladies but you know but it's not just for beards or facial hair is you know it's like your arms for the women you know what i'm saying like for women that doesn't like you know leg hairs like things are gross you know you could just use that and i want to say thank you one i want to say big thanks everybody you know like my viewers my subscribers i want to say thank you you know i only got 18 but yeah if you're new to this you know if you watch this video to let please please I really thank you and God bless you for any other ways. And thank you so much for this big birthday gift. Because I need it, you know, just in case of my neck, you know, I need to get my job and all that. All the other stuff that's been running around. So thank you guys so much for sending me this awesome Gillette razor. And hopefully you'll sponsor my videos in the future. If not, it's okay. And Thank you, Gillette. All right. So you guys, you guys already know I do gaming for my channel. I do vlogs, unboxing. I'm I'm on the grind. So hopefully this will make up for it, Gillette, and make sure that you know you 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 go buy Gillette razors. You guys are guys. You guys are 17. Here's one thing about my first shave. So it's kind of like a story time. Story time. So. I was in my intro to see, you know, it's like a high school program for high schoolers. So, intro to see is supposed to be like a military program. And I get it that most of you are going to say, oh, military program. That means that, you know, you have like Marines or something going on over there. But technically, that's, that's what it is. So, the intro to see is actually not that hard. But they do teach you a lot, though, like more... Um, man, I look so high. <laughs> on, no, just kidding. I'm not, I'm not doing any drugs or anything. I'm clean. But to be real, though, I mean, as you see, it was the best experience of my life. And um, my first time shaving was in junior year, I think. 
think junior year or sophomore year when I started going to beer, like started going a little mustache and then this is my first facial hair before all of this. But yeah, I think it was like a sophomore year so I go to mustache, so they caught me wearing my uniform, wearing a mustache. Cause you can't have this in the program. That sucks because you know, he can't show off. But it's cool though, cause my dad knows how to shave. He taught me, like you know, like you know, you need to like put you know, rinse off the razor first. At my first shaving, like it was very cool. I thought it was weird, especially in my junior year. That was like the most shaving I do, cause I've been like you know, every Tuesday night, you know, and get you know my haircut like right now. That's not acceptable. So I get like my haircut like fade, and uh chop off the top but right here this all comes down so I usually like let's use this for example so this is what I would do I just have a mirror in front of me then I just, then I just put cream first first I rinse off the razor and then I you know just get the cream and I would just spread it right here everywhere so that way it could get it I don't know what the ingredients for that but yeah I mean I don't know what the ingredients nobody knows but then of course, they got my mustache mostly when I first started. And so, you know, after that, I used this, trying to comb it, you know, trying to bring it down. You know, like, bring it down like this. I'm actually shaving because there's a cover right there. Thank you, or I'll mess up my beard even more. And so I just come down like this, you know, when I do like this, I just, in my mind, I said, that's crazy because that's the first step of becoming a man. That's my manhood. That's where you start. So you guys are like 15, 14, or 13, or even 17, and you have not shave. This is the first start of manhood with your first razor for your dad. I mean, literally, if you have like hair that's going on your shin, the one way you make it that proud is just shave it. And then let it grow it out for about, uh, well, what depends on your gene is. Like my dad, like my dad's gene, he has a beard. My brother's gene has a beard. So now I have a beard. So that's running into my family for so many years. Our daughter, man. Yeah. So, excuse me. So that's so that's how you became a, became a man. Like first stuff first, becoming a shave because you know you need to shave your beard or whatever. But that's a good thing to trim too because you know how they got these little gaps. Right here, that's the only get rid of. So that's why I'm trying to use this. Try to get this out of the way, and not having a big problem. I mean, of course, I'm gonna keep my mustache and my gold tea and my, you no, know, like my, you know, my gold tea right here. Uh, this one is kind of not visible at all. That's the thing that bothers me the most because I don't like, you know, I don't, I don't like when I have a beard and nothing's showing about right here. That's always shave it off, or don't matter what's there. So. That's why, you know, like with this all over it, you know, everybody has it like that. So I was like, now nah, let me do my own trend. Let me just calm it down and see how it looks. But yeah, so that's the first step of becoming a man. You know, like, yeah, I was like 17 years old or 15, I think, or 16. Yeah, when you're 16, you, you start to involve more. Because you actually have pimples everywhere. That's the thing that, like, back then, everybody is you know, worried about having a pimple. Because one thing for sure, having pimples is, like, going out of your face, like, randomly. You know, like, everybody don't like zits. Or nobody likes black moles. Or nobody likes that. But for me, I was like, yeah, I don't care. You know, that was the ass right there, so what? <laughs> Like, I'm always that guy that I don't care about anyways. <laughs> like, future-wise, I don't care. But, yeah, so, yeah, that's becoming a first man. You know, first step. But now, second step, becoming a man is that you need to get your ass a job. <laughs> you get a job and get, you know, get your ass going. You know, to do something in life. Like, my dad was telling me, you know, that it doesn't matter what you do. You know, you don't, you know, like, he just told me, like, right now, when I first told him that I have... Uh, a, a Gillette package, 18th birthday package. He told me that, okay, cool. That means that you could do your own thing. <laughs> but, you know, I talked to him about yesterday about, like, how I well, want a job, I ain't going to college, and something like that. He told me that doesn't matter what you do, I'm always going to be proud of you, and 
something like that. I'm just feeling, you know, blessed because I, you know, he doesn't care what I do. If I do YouTube, he might not care. I mean, he might say, like, you get paid. I'm like, hell yeah, I'm going to get paid. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to get paid for no matter what. But he did tell me a lot of things in the past, like how to, um, how to take care of your family no matter what. You know, like how to be more confident, how to be more stronger. Because when I work with him, he's a carpenter. And shout out to Eddie Kesky. You know, call him if you need houses. But yeah, so when he works on houses, he does actually taught me a lot of things. Like, if you're sweating, that means that, you know, you're, that means you're working hard. If you're bleeding, that's, that means the next level. I was bleeding for sure because I got this, I got this not that bad of a cut right here. Focus. There we go. Like, oh, I just got it. Come on, focus. My phone, I even recording from my phone. I mean, that's that's not a good thing. Right, so you can see like a nasty, like not that nasty, but if you're bleeding, you have a scar, that means that you're working harder than you are. Because, you know, like you know, everybody says, blood, blood, sweat, and tears make you feel like a man or make you feel like a powerful woman. What the hell was that? Oh. I don't know what's going on over there, but yeah. <laughs> I, I, think, I think it was my dad's TV because he doesn't allow so much, but yeah. yeah so, back to what I was saying, you know, like, what everybody said about blood, sweat, and tears, that means you work hard. So that's what my dad taught me. That's what Jolette taught me, too. I mean, like, he taught me how to, you know, be careful when you're shaving. I had my first cut right here when I was shaving because I was in a hurry. Big mistake, but it's all good because I got it done. <laughs> but, yeah, and if you guys are not shaving for some other reason, I mean, my first reason was I don't want to lose this, but it said, oh, once you shave it off, you go more thicker. I was like, okay. So I shaved it, and it goes back every single week. I was like, cool. But, yeah, that's where I came from. It was like patchy, but it's all right. I could get used to this like a whole lot of times. But yeah, so it was my little story time. But um, yeah, so I want to thank you, Gillette, for sending me a happy 18th birthday package. Even though it's in October, I mean, you know, it's like it's August, but my birthday's on July, July 25th. But uh, it was all right because I still accept whatever you guys bring me. Because I do need it though, just in case I got a job interview, I need to shave this, I keep it trend, keep it professional. That's why I want a big thank you. Alright, thank you Gillette, God bless you. And YouTube, and also for you guys that are new viewers, new people on YouTube, please subscribe to my channel. And um, and I'll do videos, I'm, I don't want to plan doing videos, like my, I'm doing randomly. Such as, such as, um... Every month or so, or every two weeks, or more than a month, because I'm going to college now. So yeah. So anyway, so thank you guys. So thank you, Gillette. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, and that's it. Peace.